There's a new TBM in town, the TBM 940. It retains the same performance as its TBM 910 and 930 predecessors, but has two major new standard features on its instrument panel, auto throttle and an automatic ice protection system. I recently flew the 940 with Nicolas Chabert, Senior VP of Daher's Aircraft Business Unit. Engine start is almost automatic. So to start this, uh, you would uh, put the fuel on auto and then uh, hit the starter. The auto throttle system allows you to set a desired airspeed. Instead of you moving the power lever, the auto throttle system does it for you. You can set the auto throttle system, it's made by Garmin by the way, manually or call up pre-programmed speed profiles for climb, cruise, and descent. This is Florida, so thunderstorms popped up and we used the Garmin GWX70 weather radar to pick our way through several clusters of cells. The 940's automatic ice protection system uses a tail-mounted vibrating probe to sense the onset of ice accretion. When ice forms, the vibration frequency changes, triggering the system into action. You can use the auto throttle for landings as well. Here we are on approach to Pompano Beach with the system holding speed until short final, when we disconnect it for landing, of course. TBMs don't have trailing link landing gear and can be a challenge to land sometimes. But this time I got a good one, and just in time, a thunderstorm was moving in. You usually see auto throttles only on big jets, but the 940 lays down a new marker for the turboprop market. Will we see the auto throttles on more turboprop singles? I think the answer is yes. Tom Horn, AOPA Live. You can read all about the TBM 940 in the October Turbine Edition of AOPA Pilot Magazine.